What's going on, everybody? Happy Monday, happy Monday. Real quick Monday video I wanted to put out there. And it was just more for some input. We're quickly getting 5,000 subscribers. I think we're now like under 300 the last I checked. So with that, I always do a giveaway. We hit the milestones. So I want to see what everybody in here thinks offhand. And there's going to be a couple different uh, things I just want to get input on. This is number one. Do you all want one big thing for me to give away where there's one winner? Or would you prefer how I did the 4,000 subscriber, do four, you know, giveaways all pretty much equal in value? Maybe add, you know, something to the top spot and everything else is equal in value. So that, that's my first question. I'll leave it up to everybody that subscribed to the channel, watches the videos and everything. Because I, I didn't know which way really to go with it. Um, I figured... If it's something big that, you know, one big thing, I can look at going to one of the shows on the 2050, either Nashville or maybe even scoot up to this one in Louisville and maybe pick something up nice that would go all around. Also, if you would just want one thing, give me a consent, you know, what sport? So um, baseball, uh, basketball or football. I'll, I'll try and leave hockey, soccer and Pokemon out because I, I know a lot of people aren't into that in this uh usually in the chat when we start talking about stuff like that. So just let me know. I'm kind of curious. If not, I could still do like something I did last time where I'll get like four or five hobby boxes and then just add something to whoever lands on top type deal again as well. All right. Uh, second thing I want to see what everybody want if this is feasible in doing. Um, a lot of times when I stock up the website, I just stock it and just let it go. If I start doing a, you know, a heavy stocking of the store one day, I can set it to where, say, like 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, it would release everything at once in the store. Um, and I can do a video saying store will be stocked at this time and everything will be on it. My question is, if I do that, does that help anybody out for that or does it really matter? And second... How high should I keep stuff in there, like, uh, like value-wise in a card? Do you think just a couple hundred should stay max into it, or should I beef it up? I mean, I can go either way with it, but a lot of times some of the higher ends, so I, what I call um, like mid cards, you know, anywhere from 300 to 1,000, sometimes they'll sit in there for a while to where I can push them on other things to move every now and then. Uh, just try to get some opinion onto that to see what everybody thinks with those, uh, with what to do with the website onto it. All right. Third thing. I'm thinking of running a contest um, based on the football games in a particular week. It'll be a subscriber thing with one giveaway. Now, you guys might have better ideas with this, but say I pick... Or I take all the games that week. You pick the winners of the teams the whole way down. Along with the final exact score. And I'll give an example. Like if it would have been tonight's game, we would have ran it. It had been like Ravens 31 and Vegas 28. And then if we have a multiple ties, I could just, you know, run a random between them or do something and figure that out. But I'm thinking about running something like that as a giveaway contest for somewhere down the road here in football season. Would that be something anybody, you know, everybody be interested in doing? I mean, it'd be a lot of tracking to do because I'd have to keep track of who all took what teams, your point totals. And then I could just put it up on a sheet just how many points you had. You know, you got, you know... I don't know how many games there are, like four. Well, right now I think there's, what, 16 games each week, 15, something like that there. You got 14 out of 15, right? Um, you know, just something like that. And we just use if there's a tiebreaker on to because I'm not too sure how many people will jump in on this. Then we go with the final score. And then if the final score is tied between, you know, more uh, two or more people get it, then we can just run a random at the end. But figure I'd throw those three things out there to see what everybody wanted offhand. Just some different ideas that I'm floating out there. Um, sometimes you guys have better ideas on the stuff too, so I figure I would just ask and open it up onto it. 
I was going to come live and do this, but I figured I'll just do the video because a lot of times being a Monday, I would have to come on a little bit later to try to catch all the different time zones and stuff. But just with something different offhand. All right, everybody. Take care. Have a good week. And I'll catch you all in the next video.